Right now we're heading into Buenos Aires uh, towards Matias' apartment. And we're gonna meet up with Matias and Ramiro and they're gonna be coming along on a couple storm chases with us. And they gave us a lot of useful information about how to forecast severe weather here and some of the climatology in the local area. Ramiro and Matias are very interested in, in meteorology and severe weather, but they've actually never seen a tornado. It's a nice place, it's beautiful here. Yeah. Casa is house, right? House, yeah. House, okay. We can learn some Spanish too on this trip. We'll learn uh, Apriende Espanol. Yeah. Do easterly storm motion, that'd be perfect. But we gotta shoot north fast. You can see the front maybe even right there. Yeah, we should move north. Yeah. Santa Rosa. We are heading north. This is really an amazing experience, so we'll, we'll just try to repeat it as much as we can. Is that a funnel? Look at that! If it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen right there. That's the mesocyclone there. It's gonna circulate the wrong way. <laughs> or the right way down here. This is a dream come true. I can't believe this is happening. We see how it spins in all this area. We're all spinning and forming multiples. Incredible, sinceramente incredible. Impagable. Dale! That's gonna do it. That's gonna do it. Whoa! Yes! Donde eso te da la idea de. We're getting in the car. We gotta go north. Oh my God, can you roll your window? This is the most beautiful supercell I've ever seen. Uh, you can see the striations, it's rotating this way. You can see the Cordoba Mountains behind it. Now this could easily produce a tornado. It's got scud fingers hanging down and it's rapidly rotating. And then there's hail streaks there off to the left. There's big time hail falling right there. I wouldn't mind getting into some of that hail. What a day. I wouldn't want to be anywhere in the world except for right here. I'm hoping they can get going again here further east. Uh, but they're definitely struggling. That's what's left of our storm. The tornadoes and storms are very elusive here in Argentina, but that also makes it more rewarding when you make an accurate forecast and you put yourself in the right position to see a supercell. We did see incredible supercell structure today, and I really thought we were gonna get one, but it didn't quite plant in the ground.